my dear sisters and brothers in Christ Christ is risen hallelujah i wish you all a happy and blessed easter we have been preparing for this day for the last 40 days with fasting and prayer today we celebrate because jesus is risen from the dead and the door for a new life has been opened for us from the gospel passages it is clear that the disciples did not fully comprehend what jesus had told them about the resurrection mary magdalene thinks that jesus is the gardener and someone has stolen his body peter sees the linen clothes in the tomb and cannot work out what really happened but the confusion will soon be cleared and the course of their lives has changed forever by this event the world and human history had permanently transformed as the power of god overcome death a new form of life and a new dimension of creation had been inaugurated which is not threatened by death jesus has not just escaped death but destroyed it from within nobody including the disciples was prepared for what actually happened listen to the words of the angels to the women who were looking for the body of jesus in the tomb you seek jesus of nazareth who was crucified he has risen he is not here Jesus does not remain in the tomb but is among those who are alive with a totally new life they are trying to understand and describe something which has never happened or will never happen again in history easter is the central event of human history the point to which everything emerges new god has come near to us in jesus and has done something unique which gives a new shape and meaning to our lives during the easter services we light the paschal candle representing christ and then ignite the candles in our hands from this candle this light gives us so much hope and it should reach the corners of the earth to remove the darkness this celebration is more meaningful in the present situation when the whole world is going through fear and darkness we pray and hope that with the help of jesus who defeated darkness and death we will be able to overcome the present crisis even in nature we see that the night is shorter as light increases every day Saint Paul says Rejoice in the Lord always again I will say rejoice The celebration of the resurrection invites us to witness to Easter There is so much freedom in knowing that Jesus has defeated death for us This is the joy of the easter vigil we are free 
in the resurrection of Jesus love has been shown to be stronger than death and stronger than evil his death is the cause of our life Jesus resurrection is the source and principle of our own future resurrection to eternal life our faith in the risen lord should transform our lives all those who have witnessed the resurrection have been given a solemn commission the faithful women who witnessed the resurrection became the first witnesses of the resurrection to the apostles now let us try to spread the joy of resurrection by proclaiming to the rest of the world that jesus is risen let us also try to be a reflection of the light of Christ in today's world in removing the surrounding darkness once again i wish all of you a happy and blessed easter jesus is risen hallelujah